All right, I've got a uh, new style for cross guards for Profi OS4. I'm calling this one Real Flame, um, and it's a fully responsive fire style. Um, and this color is Real Flame because it's got the, the bright uh, yellow center, and then it works its way out towards the red. Um, and then using the fully responsive controls from Profi OS4, what happens with this flame is if you point the saber straight up, the fire is going to be at its fastest and most intense. And then as you move that blade down, it'll slow the flame a little bit. And then if you get below horizontal, it'll actually not only slow the flame and cool it, but it'll actually shrink that flame as well. Till you're straight up and down, you'll actually get the smallest of the flames, it'll slow itself down a lot, and it'll dim. Um, so the idea is as if a, you really had a torch facing downward, that fire is going to fight back on itself so you get that shrinking effect. Um, and it's responsive in real time, so any little subtle change to the angle of that blade is going to change the size of that fire. And then once you have it pointing straight up again, it'll be at its fastest. Um, and then in addition, this style also features a lot of the new fully responsive effects. So it's got the, the responsive blast. So that blast location is based on the angle of your blade. Same with clash. So instead of just being randomized, it actually is based on that angle. Um, so it allows you to control where it's at. And then that leads to the responsive lockup. And that lockup location will move as you move your blade. So if you're locked up with somebody and you move defensively, it slides down. Offensively, it moves up. And then you get the transitions in and out. Um, and then we also now have with OS4, we've got the new melt feature. Um, so that's meant to be as if you were melting a surface. And it'll allow you to just turn in your hilt to change that temperature from a red to yellow orange. Um, and then lastly, we do have the new lightning block for OS4. So that's lightning block, and it's meant to show lightning dancing across the blade. And you can actually bring that blade up and focus it to the middle. And with lightning block, if you're below uh, horizontal when that blade shrinks, it, lightning block will deactivate. But your other effects will stay in line. So your blast and clash will all respond to the fact that that, that fire is now smaller. Um, so this is just uh, another new style that uses all the responsive capabilities of OS4 to give you just some really cool effects. Um, so this is up on the OS4 library. Um, OS4 is in beta right now. If you want to give it a try, it's pretty solid. Um, we're just finishing out beta testing, and then once it's all done, it'll be in full release. Um, but this style is ready to go. Um, and I, I do have multiple other colors available. Um, but this one is the version I'm calling Real Flame. And as you can see, it's because it, it's meant to mimic a real fire. Um, so lots more to come for OS4. Um, but just wanted to share this one. So uh, enjoy.